Eight steps towards mastering the art of manifestation. Our life is a manifestation, and we can very well make that manifestation beautiful and meaningful and have a good influence. Thich Nhat Han I posted a question on our Facebook page last week, asking my dear Facebook friends how good are they at manifesting things, how good are they at attracting what they want in their lives, and usually they engage and answer to these questions but this time, not so much, and I thought that maybe it's time to write a post on how to manifest wonderful things, how to attract that which you want and need in your life, in order to live a happy, meaningful, healthy and prosperous life. 8 Steps Towards Mastering the Art of Manifestation 1. Know what you want. Ask yourself, what is it that I want? What do I need in my life in order to really be happy? 2. Know why do you want what you want? Know why do you want what you want, and make sure that it's exactly what you need, because you see, just as the saying goes, be careful what you wish for, cause you just might get it, and that is why it's so important to acknowledge why you want what you want and if you really need it or not. 3. Know who would benefit from it. Who would benefit from having these things happen, who would benefit once you have these wishes fulfilled? Is it only you or are there any other people involved? The more people will benefit from it, the better. For example, I want to help as many people as possible to discover their unique gifts and talents, to discover how beautiful and powerful they really are, and to help them make their lives a masterpiece. This is just an example so that you will get a better picture of what I am talking about. 4. Assume the feeling of the wish fulfilled. How would you feel once you get what you want? How would you feel once you have this wish as materialized? How would you feel once you make your dreams become reality? Powerful, free, happy, content, relaxed, joyful? Then choose to embrace all of these feelings, as if whatever you want, has already happened. Start with the end in mind and assume the feeling of the wish fulfilled. 5. Act as if. Know that whatever you want, it's already here and it's only a matter of time until you bring it into form. It's just like Wayne Dyer said it, everything that is created in the universe is here already. We are not really creators as much as we are recombiners of everything. Know that whatever you need, the universe will supply. Know it and act upon this knowing. Leave all or your doubts behind. 6. Choose gratitude over whining and complaining. Leave your whining, criticism, doubts, complaining, etc. behind and choose to express gratitude for every single thing in your life. Feel all of those feelings that come from having all your needs and desires met, and choose to express your gratitude for them all, every single day. 7. Let go of doubt. A lot of people say that they want to get good at manifesting, that they want to work on improving themselves, and also on attracting all kind of great things in their lives, and they stay on the right track for a couple of days, weeks, or maybe months, and then they give up. Because they don't see things happening as fast as they would like them to happen, they give up. They start complaining that it's not working, that it will never happen, that it only works for a few people, etc., and most of them give up, not knowing that what they need it's already on the way, and they go back to being a victim. Whether you believe it or not, there are people who are so accustomed to playing the victim card, there are people who, whenever things start working a lot better for themselves, they get scared and they find a way to be unhappy again. It's much easier to do that than take responsibility for your life and for the incredible power that is hidden in each and every single one of us. 8. Meditate to manifest. Another thing you might want to do is to meditate, and while you meditate, pick one thing that you want to achieve. See yourself already as already being there, see yourself as already having achieved your dreams, your goals, and desires, and see how happy you are, feel those feelings, get familiar with them, embrace them, own them. 
don't put a deadline on your dreams, but rather know that it's going to happen, it happened in your mind and it will definitely happen in the real life, and be ready to embrace the opportunities that will come your way, be ready to encounter all kind of wonderful people who would want to help you get wherever you want to get, and also, get ready for all kind of interesting coincidences, that will come your way. I personally meditate on what I want to create in the morning, after I wake up, before having breakfast, and before I go to bed, I meditate, to express my gratitude for all the things that happened during the day, and all the things that didn't but I know they will, and I thank for them all in advance, because you see, the best way to attract what you want in your life, is to express your gratitude in advance, and really mean it, and really feel it. By doing so, wonderful things will happen to you, with you, and because of you. For me, doing all of the above worked really good so far, and I know it will for you too, because you see when you really want something, and especially, if that something will help others also, the whole universe will conspire to have your needs met. We are not alone. If we ask, we will receive, but if we don't because we know that nothing will happen, in the end, we will get exactly what we expect to get, nothing.